Hey guys, Tales of Creed here, and welcome back to some more Let's Play Trails of Cold Steel. Last time we left off, we arrived in Ruhr after boarding the uh, Courageous. I was having trouble saying that. Um, so Prince Oliver gave us a ride over. Pretty cool. Got to show off his his new toy, and uh, how Cap the captain of the ship is Laura's father, Viscount Arsite. So there you go. <laughs> This time around, we're going to be finishing up today's uh, field study. Well, what the? F no, probably not finishing it up, but we're going to be doing. We're going to be finishing up this day of the field study. I can figure things out on my own. I promise. Anyway, I decided to start us here since the quest is here. So let's go talk to a dude. Pretty much, dude. Yep. Oh, so you know George. George is my pal. We hang out all the time. Sounds like it. I think we'll be okay, though. You know, we're usually pretty good in fights, so I'm not too worried. So, uh, yeah, just let me know. Professor Schmidt? Yeah, I think so. Oh well, yeah, that would that would make you pretty popular. <laughs> hmm. Oh, so one of uh, Epstein's students, Professor Russell, also being one of Epstein's students, and also one that you probably know from Sky. So there you go. You mean the place that we're at right now? <laughs> you don't say. Fair enough. Oh, well, that's cool. Makes sense, you know. Tends to happen with old people. Oh, excuse me. My, um, I just ate, actually, so my throat's a little groggily, I guess. I don't know. But, um, I didn't want to record, so I was like, eh, fuck it. So you may hear me clear my throat a few times. I may try and cut that out if possible. So I do apologize if you hear that. Oh well, that's pretty cool. That's what Elliot and Emma use. Pretty much. <laughs> well, it's kind of a different world from you, Fee. No offense. Oh, really? Well, uh, that's pretty big. Coming from the big man himself. Is 
sure. That'd be cool. I like moving into things. So, um, alright, so he wants to enter the mine. That's fine. We can do that. Bring back a small... <clears throat> oh, excuse me. Minor metal called linea. Sure. I have also never heard of Linium. <laughs> really? Huh. Well, that would be pretty cool. Oh, well, you know, why wouldn't it be? <laughs> Well, yeah, we know that. Okay. Oh, so you want us to kill dudes. You know, that's part of the job that we take care of. We take care of a lot of killing dudes. So, um, yeah, that's fine. You can just go down there and kill a few dudes. Yeah, I can see that happening. Oh, man. Maybe this wasn't a good idea, because my throat's, like, really getting on me. So I may have to make a small cut and... get rid of that, if I can. So basically, we just have to be the person who gets chosen, because he doesn't want to go to the, um... To the army, there's no bracers around anymore, so, uh, yeah. That ma yeah, that makes sense. So, just have us do that job. <laughs> Maybe so. That'd be pretty cool. Why not? All right. The best kind of caution. <laughs> cool. That was a long conversation. Jesus. I forgot how long some of these conversations to, like, start quests can be. Which can be a little uh, overwhelming when you're doing a Let's Play. Because you're like, oh shit, we're actually having, like, a real conversation about everything right now. Like, we got a whole history lesson from that. <laughs> I'm like, oh, fuck. So, um, let's see. So, we can get going. Uh, the Saksen... I don't really know how to say that. The Saksen Mountain Path? Well, it is a mountain path. <laughs> Sorry, Crow. It's just how life is sometimes. Alright, 
So just as the same as any other pathway, there's going to be monsters awaiting us. And of course, treasure chests to find. As per usual. Um, the music here is a little bit different also. It's kind of crazy. I, I'm listening to it now. I'm like, oh yeah, I kind of forgot how kind of different this music is. Yeah, I knew you were going to do that. See how some of these enemies are though? Check them out. There is also going to be one fish on this uh, pathway. So, I'm going to try and get that as well. Um, so we did get flame impact. I can try that out. Show that off. There you go. It just kills dudes. Let's keep moving. That was thanks to domination, of course. So, or of course, <laughs> uh, kill me. So, that's a thing. Um, this pathway can be rather long, though. I believe there's like three segments to it. So we should probably just get started and get rolling. Um, okay, so we want to get every tre tre treasure chest. Treasure chest. These enemies are really weird looking as well. There you go. This one's all ours. Go. So the cool thing about just blowing your CP with Reen is like his Master Quartz just lets you get it all back once you kill them. So there's no real point not to use Flame Impact and kill them. So might as well do that. But anyway, new en new enemies, of course, so I'm going to be showing them off as per usual. And then when we uh, fight them again, then I'll cut it out. I was scared he was going to keep chasing me. <laughs> Now's our chance. We can do this. Go. Yeah, we can try Gale. I don't think Gale's going to kill. Eh, Gale, Gale kills. Never mind. I'm at 200 CP now. God, his Master Quartz is insane. Laura's is really good, because you can just keep boosting, boosting on your power. And you just get really strong. But his CP, like, you can just keep using his special attacks over and over again, because his CP gets refilled. That one looks oh god. Watch out. Jesus Christ. Okay, fine. This looks tough. Careful. My turn. Alright, let's see what we can do here. Um need some earth spells. Um could motivate. Alright. Why not? Do this. Probably don't have to, but um I'm doing it anyway. Grand press. Get some of that in. And then, um... We could try this. <laughs> Get it? Freezing. It's cool. Okay. Get that guy, and then I think with My Reen, turn. we're just gonna fucking kill them. Burn to ash. Goodbye. That's the power of the eight leaves. For some reason, I remember those guys giving a little bit more experience, but I guess not. I guess I'm just crazy. So, whatever. Not a lot of experience, though, going around right now, unfortunately. You can see all of Ruwer spread out from here. You can, though the view isn't as nice as it'd be from the front. Well, yeah, pretty much. Now that's what I call a chest. That is a nice chest. Thank you. Petrify Quartz. So we can see a little bit of where we're going now when we're up here. But we can't... I wish we could jump down from here, but unfortunately we can't. So you actually need to run back. So that kind of sucks. 
I can't really see all that well. So that's why I'm running into walls. Alright, back on the road. Let's actually get moving. Oh man, more dudes. There's a lot of enemies here. I don't know if we've seen this enemy. Or it's a re Like, it might be a reskin, you motherfucker. God damn it, can you stop being annoying? Come on. Thank you. Sometimes the enemies can be really annoying. I think in the second game it's a lot easier. I don't know what they did with the monsters in the second game, but they just reach a certain point and always turn back. But sometimes in this game you reach a certain point and then they just keep chasing you even more. It's kind of weird. Um, let's see. What if we just... Oh, I can't get all three? Damn it. Yeah, I guess scale. Just kill these three. Or not. Cool. Nice. Leave Did not me. expect that to kill that bad guy, so that was pretty good. <laughs> you picked the wrong guy to mess with. Get some level ups for um yeah, Crow well, and uh Machius. Very nice. Alright, so next up we need to get this chest. Best by treasure. Me too. Pretty good course. I think that's for um, different, a better time magic. I think it's one of the better uh, pieces of magic in the game. Hello, friend. Damn it. <laughs> Handsome and strong. I'm the total package. Alright, so we got some more level ups, along with Crow being really cool for some reason. Right. Nice so Elliot job. levels up and Elisa levels up. Very nice. Alright, with that done, we get a Tiro Bomb. Very nice. Ew. Mine. Alright, I think that is about it for this. This? Don't know where that T came from. Um, this pathway. So, these guys did give a pretty good amount of experience, so maybe I should fight. Sometimes they turn around! God damn it. There we go. Well, unfortunately, there was only two of them, so it didn't really end up being anything noteworthy. So that kind of sucks, but oh well. Let's keep going. Um, coming up in this second part, though, you can see some... Oops. Sorry, I just scrolled down real quick. You can see some water. Um, there is actually going to be a fish back here. I think I said that already, so my bad. But let's go back here and grab this chest. It's over here. Oh, a train track. That's the freight line that runs into the mine. Very nice. So if possible, I would like to uh, skip this guy. Get the Black Bell Quartz. Gonna try and avoid a few fights, because don't really want to fight every enemy. If I was playing on my own, though, probably. Alright, let's see. The fishing spot's going to be up there, so I think we just need to get this chest. Yeah, looks like it. Oh, I'm about to turn around because I'm dumb. Oh, I'm gonna need a rest before we even get there. <sighs> yeah, I wasn't expecting- Motherfucker! Oh, 
treasure chest. All right, that wasn't that bad. Speed breaker. That's pretty good quartz. Um, let's take a look at that. Don't I have that already, or am I crazy? Or is I have rock sha sha. Um, we did get black belt. Oh yeah, I did have a speed breaker. Has delay after using time darts. Pretty good. Um, I also got the um that quartz. Yeah, this is a this is pretty much the best spell for mirage magic. Pretty dang good. All right, so there should be a fishing spot right up here, somewhere. This looks like a nice spot. Here we go. So we need to catch a fish here real quick. Kind of forgot which one, but I guess we'll see. This is actually going to be our second to last fish, though. So you can tell we're actually... Oh, yeah. You can tell we're actually getting to the end. Oh, I hate when it's fucking square, dude. Oh, there we go. What even is Invisible this? crayfish. Very nice. So that's 19 out of 20. One of our final fish in the game. We're getting there. We're doing it, guys. Um, this is a pathway back um, over to... Where does it go? Isengard ran Range? We're not actually, actually supposed to go that way. So just ignore it. Don't really want to fight you. Be careful. So I'm just not going to. Oh god, there's one of those chests down there. Does this go? Oh yeah, this does go down. Uh, well, let's go um take care of that chest. That god nice damn it. <laughs> oh, actually I didn't even know about this place. It is pretty good. That's a lot of Sepith. That's totally worth it. Alright. Can I... I'll probably just fight you. There you go. Nice work. I was just following your lead. Hey, level up. Get a level up for Fee, my girl. It's my girl, Fee. Alright, and we got this final chest, which I'm probably just gonna end up cutting out anyway, because it's usually just dudes we saw on the way. Hooray! Holy fuck! Fuck it. Hell yeah, man! Dude, that was sick. Mission complete. Very nice, guys. That is a shit ton of experience. Holy fuck. Okay, you material? Reen's leveling up? Ooh, that felt good. So we get a Brahma gem for the win. Um, let me check what that is real quick. So, that has that. That's a lot of boost in fucking ATS. So, I think I might put that on if I can. That's pretty fucking good. Um, I might have to give this up. Or I can just get rid of Mine 3. Because Mine 3 just gives magic. So, yeah, I think that's what I'll do. So, it's really just a 40 increase, but... I don't know. I could keep mine three on if I got rid of Grim Butterfly or something, but I'll keep it. Alright, so welcome to the mine. It's uh, pretty big. Maybe. Maybe a little. <laughs> I 
It is uh, fairly big. They've been working on this for a very long time. <laughs> so, um, I mean, at this point, they've dug through quite a bit, but it's still, it's still fucking kicking. Oh, very nice. Pretty much. That'd be pretty bad. <laughs> yeah, why not? What car? Oh, that one? Oh, I was like, um... Oh, you know what? That probably belongs to the roadway military police, yeah. So maybe Claire's down there. <laughs> or, not the roadway, railway. Sorry. What a coincidence that Claire might be here. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, I'm sorry, I said roadway instead of railway. This is my bad. Alright, so we finally reached the place. Let's go check it out. What up, homie? Yeah, but we got, like, we got Lisa. So don't worry about it. Okay, I see what's going on. I had to look at my map real quick, but we are pretty much good. Let's just go in. Oh man, it's Rudolph. The main man himself behind the mine. Also, Claire, I guess, wasn't here. I thought she might have been. Yeah, man, we're all here, coming to hang out and uh, do some shit. We also kind of have a, 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 bleh, a request to check out the mine, so um, hope you don't mind. How adorable. No. <laughs> Sorry. No, Crow. Crow. Get out of here. Seems like it. Surprise you know Angelica. Yeah, she's doing all right. Oh, wow. Well, you know what? I guess that kind of makes sense. 
considering the type. Yeah, she is one of four gray houses. <laughs> or part of one of four gray houses, but she was like, eh, fuck it. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go to work. Nice. <laughs> yeah, kind of the same way. Poor crow. Well, what can you do? Yeah, Arena can be a little... abrasive. Yeah, what were they doing here? D don't mean to cut between uh, the whole mother situation, but what were the railway military police doing here? Really? Huh. Kind of weird. Not really. I mean, you pretty much know the reason we're here. Pretty sure we uh, talked about it. Or maybe he was just told that we were coming here. He wasn't told of why. So, nah, eh, whatever. Really? Yeah, why not? Let's fucking do it. We can take care of it. Pretty much. Alright, so he's going to be giving us the mineshaft key. So we're going to get going on this thing. So no one's been inside for years. So that means there are bad things in there. Alright. So you can take a small look around. Just people around and doors that we can't go in. And I need to sneeze, holy shit. Ooh. So the shitty thing I realize is Elliot is a little low on um, EP. So I'm gonna throw him that. Should be good enough, I think. But besides that, let's go. So, this place is going to be kind of a dungeon, but it's only one place and it's very short, so don't worry, it's not going to be very long or anything. That would be a little weird.
All right. So we just need to be careful in here. Make sure we don't eat shit. There is one treasure chest in here as well as the monster down there. So just make sure to grab that chest while we're here and we should be uh, pretty god dang good. Um, but yeah, be careful the enemies around here. Because there's fucking rats. And that's not a rat, that's, that's just a creepy ass bug. That we saw in the very first dungeon in the game. <laughs> In the abandoned or the old schoolhouse, actually. But let's see if they're any stronger. Uh, let's just do Gale. See if they die right away. Yes, they do. So don't have to worry about it. That's that. Let's keep moving. Bunch of level ups. Very nice. Get they drop you materials. That's worth it. Please hold your applause. Fifty-four. Get chaos trigger. Fires a bolt of pure bullet of pure insanity. <laughs> okay. An a plus outcome. So everyone's level fifty-four. I think the only ones that aren't are Fee and Oh, what a nice looking treasure chest. Fee and Rain. Yeah. Purgatorial Flame. I think that's a really strong skill, but it's like it has a small radius. Let me take a look. I like uh, Hellfire, so I'm probably not gonna put it on, but yeah, area is small, but it summons the flames of Gehenna, so um, that's pretty good. God damn it! Can you stop being annoying, please? Damn it! That was my own fault. There we go. All right, fat bats. Didn't realize that was going to rhyme until I said it, but we have fat bats. Alright, so let's see here. Got this that we could do. Yeah. They're a little beefy, but took care of two. There we go. Is everybody okay? Experience here isn't bad. It's pretty good. If you're getting a good amount of enemies. But we took care of that. And then we just gotta go down there. That one chest is pretty much the only thing that matters. In this chest. Or in this dungeon. <laughs> in this chest. So I really don't care. I'm just gonna go down. Yeah, I guess we could. Or we can fight a dude. That's- oh my god, that's the mushroom. That's a mushroom, man. Alright, so we got a fight. With uh, Vinny Vine Sauce, Mushroom Boy. So, so the thing is, I'm I'm starting to notice a thing with domination. When I use motivate, when I use motivate, motivate, I think it uses the thing. So I'm gonna try and hold off on that. Um, let's see. I guess like maybe not. Well, he has twenty three thousand. Was it weak to fire? Yeah, why not? I get all my uh, CP back really quickly anyway, so I feel like it's worth it. Get fucked. And then we have Chaos Trigger now. Which I would use, but I'm gonna hold off because I want to hit everyone. These guys are dead, and he's frozen. <laughs> Jesus, this guy got fucked. Oh, wait. Flare bomb. <laughs> this guy got fucked, dude. He's like, deader than dead. Targets 
eliminated. Let's get going. <sighs> experience is pretty nice. So fees leveling up, get a lot of experience, get one new material. Very nice. He also dropped a Zerum Powder, I just realized. I didn't say anything about that, but that's fucking awesome. And we get Bullet Cyclone, which is a really good skill for our feet. So, very cool. A hey, Linium. Cool. That's kind of what we needed. <laughs> Pretty much. Alright, so we got our Linium. Doing pretty good after that battle. Worked out. So I guess for now, let's head back out. You know, now that I'm running around as Crow, like I really feel like he's super tall. I didn't like realize how tall he is, but then you look at the menu and he's like fucking gigantic like he's the tallest me member of the party <laughs> i don't know like it's crazy look at fee in fee in comparison to crow it's like insane so <laughs> it's cool so we just gotta leave and then we should be good just gotta go talk to the mine chief real quick and then uh we can head back which, if they're going to make me walk back, I'll probably just cut to when we get there. To make things easier. So, hey, man. Sure. Alright, so I guess we just have to walk back. So, I will probably see you there in a hot minute, since I don't think there's anything along the way. So yeah, I guess I'll meet you there.